have seen some talk, even some movie references about this one <laughs> online. NASA projects an asteroid will fly by Earth early next week. Given its size, the agency is considering it a potentially hazardous object. Chief Meteorologist Bobby Deskins joins us now to put this in context for us. Bobby, look up. No, I'm just teasing. Yeah, yeah, the right? good The good news is it's supposed to fly by. Yeah, Let's kids, see. do your homework. You, we're not going to miss school on this one or the rest of the world or anything like that. <laughs> it's not ending. <laughs> <laughs> it's not. Let's talk about the size first. So I, what I've shown you here is the Skyway Bridge. And you see that this little area right here between the top span here, the two towers, that's about 2,000 feet. Now let's take a look at the size of this asteroid. It's almost a third larger than that. That's huge. Anything over 500 feet, NASA considers to be a pretty big problem. This thing well over that, as you can see. Now let's talk about where it is and how far it's going to be. There's the Earth with the moon going around. Oh, other side. There's the Earth with the moon going around, right? The Earth and the moon, the distance there is about, on average, 238,000 feet. The most is about 252. The least is about 225,000 feet, right? That's a pretty decent distance, but this thing is going to be even further apart than that. Over a million miles, 1.2 million miles. This is not drawn to scale. If I drew that asteroid to scale to show you what it looked like compared to the Earth, you wouldn't see it. It's super, super tiny. This is not going to affect us. And in fact, 1.2 million miles away, back in 1933, this same asteroid came within about 700,000 miles from us. So it's not an issue now, wasn't an issue then, won't be an issue in 2105 when it comes back. So I think we're going to be good on this one.